What's up everybody, Flying Scorpion here with Stellaris modding tutorial video number five, localization files. Picking up where we left off, we created a custom trait called overpowered breeders. And the way we did that was we copied the rapid breeders trait, which already exists in the game, into our mod folder and then just modified it to, be, to create overpowered breeders. But there's the small error. The localization key has not been set up. And then when you hover over it in the game, the pop-up just doesn't look very good. So we're going to fix that in this video. Since we copied the rapid breeders trait and the rapid breeders trait when you hover over it has a nice looking localization file or localization string of text, uh, we can assume safely that the localization key already exists for rapid breeders. And so we'll just copy that over into our mod folder and use that to base our work off of. The process of finding uh, files that you can base your work off of is a bit of a skill and it takes a while to develop that skill. So I'll teach you how to search for something like that in uh, Visual Studio Code. We're gonna open up a new window and we're gonna click on Browse and we're going to open up the Stellaris folder. This is the base vanilla version of the game. We're gonna search for all examples of the word breeder to try and find these rapid breeders and where it is in the, uh, in the game. And if you scroll through, you're going to see there's this file, l underscore English dot YML, and it's in the folder, Stellaris Localization English. So this looks like the right path. And if you click in here, you'll see Trait Rapid Readers. There's some text in here. This is what we're looking for. There's also Trait Rapid Breeders Lithoid and Slow Breeders. We don't want that, but we do want this part, Rapid Breeders. So we're going to close out of this. And we're going to open up that folder path, uh, Stellaris Localization English. Stellaris Localization English L underscore English, just like here. We're going to copy that file into our mod folder, but we're not going to just paste it right into the base folder. We need to recreate the same folder path or, or file path that we used to get to the original file. So localize low localization and then English and then we paste in the dot uh, YML file now if we don't rename this file it's going to overwrite the original version of this file in the game and we don't want to do that we're going to rename it if you look at all the other localization files in the base game they all follow the same format AI underscore crisis underscore L underscore English dot YML or ancient relics of what events, blah, 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 underscore L, underscore English dot YML. We're going to use the same formatting for our localization file. So we're going to name it tutorial underscore L, underscore English dot YML, and that should work. Now let's uh, close out of this and uh, open up this file here. So we're going to have a lot of stuff in here that we don't need, but at the top it says L underscore English. Do we need to keep that? Well, let's open up some of the other localization files. This one has L underscore English at the top. This one has L underscore English at the top. So chances are we do need to, to keep this. Let's uh, search for breeders again. And we're gonna just take the stuff that we wanna work with. And we're gonna keep this L underscore English thing at the top. And we're gonna delete everything else and just leave behind what we need. Rapid breeders. Okay, so we want to change this to OP breeders because our uh, our custom trait is OP breeders. Now your capitalization matters here. So in order to reduce the chance of human error, we're going to do a find and replace. Clicking on the left hand side, click this drop down, find and replace rapid breeders, and we're going to replace it with exactly. What, our, uh, what we're trying to do here, and that's OP breeders. See, if you didn't capitalize that B, it would mess it up. So now, we'll hit Control, Alt, Enter, and that'll replace it perfectly. Then we're gonna change this to say overpowered, and then we're gonna say this species reproduces at an alarming rate, an alarming rate, and then we're gonna save the file, and now let's test it out in the game and see if it works. So we're in the game now, and here is our overpowered breeders trait, and indeed, it's working perfectly fine. Uh, it says overpowered breeders, the species it produces at an alarming rate. So there you go, that's how to create a custom trait and set up the localization file for it in Solaris. Thanks for watching, I'm Flying Scorpion. Please leave a like, and I'll see you in the next one.